If you use a Windows computer, you know how important it can be to have good antivirus software. Today we're going to show you how to install it and set it up. First, just head to the website of an antivirus program that you like. We're going to use Microsoft Security Essentials because it's probably the easiest to set up and it does a great job of protecting you from threats. Download the software and install it on your computer. The install process should go pretty much like any other program. Just hit next, accept the license terms when it asks you to. I like to join the customer experience program and make sure the Windows firewall is turned on. It'll take a minute to install, so just let it do its thing. When it's done, it will ask you to run a scan on your computer. Let it download the newest virus definitions so it can find the latest viruses. And then let it run its scan. Again, this will all take a few minutes, so just let the computer do its thing while it scans. When it's done doing its scan, you want to do one more thing, which is change your scan schedule. So click the Change My Scan Schedule link. I usually like to do a full scan at Sunday at 2 a.m. Most of the default settings are fine, though you can change it to run at any day you want. I like to run it on Sunday at 2 a.m. because that's when I know I'll probably be sleeping and I won't be interrupting anything. Save your changes and you're done. It'll constantly be monitoring your computer for any incoming viruses and let you know if anything comes up. You can tell it's running by going to your system tray and looking for the green castle icon. Remember, antivirus software is great, but the best way to stay safe on the net is to have safe browsing habits. Don't click on anything claiming to be antivirus software if you don't know where it's from. Don't click on any suspicious Facebook posts. And only click on links in your email if they're from someone that you trust. With those tips and a good antivirus installed, you should be pretty safe from any incoming threats in the future.